Greetings, this is Bloodrill, and welcome back to Let's Play the Technomancer. Where we're about to go and uh, find our captain. And ask her to look into some archive uh, files for us. Yeah, come for it. These guys are very good at killing each other. In your face. How many of you guys are there? Jesus. Wow. I should have healed, but I thought it wouldn't actually kill me with one blow. Apparently I was wrong. Look at that damage. God damn it. Nope. Nope. Fuck you. You want it? Come get it. You little bitch. God damn it. That's so annoying. How many are there? I think there must be at least six. Of them there. Yep, I'm friendly. Yeah, fuck you. You got one, guys. Good job. That's a lot of them still. Come on! What the fuck are you doing? Attack! This game sometimes... Stop annoying me! Everybody has a weapon! Wow. That goes bullshit. Not only they have a weapon, they apparently are masters at the dodging shit. That was annoying as fuck. God damn. Really? Apparently he is wearing super armor and a super heavy sword, but... Um, hammer. 
But it's still as fast as uh, the light gates for those reasons. Fuck off. Jesus, that fight was annoying. I really want to kill them all now. They also have no items, although they are fully decked. Screw you, game. Man, I'm seeing the ending fights gonna... The ending fights, actually. Are gonna annoying the shit out of me. I'm seeing it coming. Doesn't help that we don't actually get any new armor or weapons. I've been with this armor for half the game, basically. Captain, good to see you. I really need some information about Scott Seeker's son. Like, what happened to him after he got arrested? You know how monitored we are, Zachariah? What do you want? I go poking around, we could find ourselves fired. Or worse, for a mutant? We are a mutant. Whatever we find isn't going to bother anyone today, but it could bring some peace to the people who never stopped loving or wondering what happened to the boy. The more I learn about it, the more complicated it gets. I'm just trying to bring some peace, Captain. Just look into some dusty files. No one's going to care. All right. It's so going to die Hope for keeping right, us. Zachariah. I'll dig into the archives. Yeah. It'll take some time. Tomorrow would be the earliest. Tomorrow it is. Thank you. I'll come back then. Ah. Oh. Really? Oh, that's annoying. Sounds like I can actually wait here. Yeah. Why the fuck are there third people everywhere? Alright, I refuse to <laughs> spend more healings for these fights. God damn. I guess we need to go out and come in again, I don't know. It will take a while for the time to pass. Alright, where shall I put you? Let's put you on 6 and put that on 0. What? No, let's put you on 6, I said. Wow, I have flashlight. I completely forgot about that. All right. Yeah, there is nothing there. 
Why would they put that in when I can't rest anywhere right now in the city of fear? That's a weird design choice. How the hell will I pass the time? Should I leave and come back at another day? Or should I just he sit here and wait for the 10 hours to pass like that? Unless there is a command to pass the time, which I'm missing. Hmm. Is there a pastime thing? Probably not. Well, that was a good choice then. Seriously though. Alright, you know what? I'll cut this episode here and I'll pick you up uh, when uh, the time has passed. And the back. Alright. That took like 15 minutes, by the way. If you were wondering. <laughs> now I'm guessing we'll have to fight more guys. Because they will have respawned. At least on the way out. Captain, good to see you. So what did you learn? Strange things. Scott Seeker was, apparently, much more respected back in the day. He even managed to convince the army at one point that he could heal and trigger mutation. The idea of triggering mutations apparently really got some interest. And the army launched a new division and put him in charge. He even brought him a few mutants to run tests on. One of which was his son. Obviously never went anywhere. Nobody got healed. The program was shut down and the mutants, including his son, were terminated. So sad. Almost makes you want to look at the old man differently. Wow. Sure does. Thank you, Captain. That's hers. What a horrifying story. To think that a father's desperation to change his son ended with getting the boy killed. It was to change him back. He didn't start off like that. You've seen how bad those bastards get treated in abundance. No wonder he was so desperate. It was a chance at a better life. I understand that. I, truly, I do. However, I believe that instead of perilously trying to change his son's life, he should have protected his future. Help him live with That's his That's kinda future. hypocritical coming from you. Since you're not a mutant and all. Mutants are basically slaves in abundance. I mean, it's not like uh, he knew of uh, a free mutant city or something. It's always easy to judge people uh, from afar, from having not actually lived uh, through whatever they live through. Which is what I'm also guilty of. Of course, multiple times. Oh yeah, again the combat with 10 people. What exactly are you doing, uh, Amelia? Not sure. At least Nyesa managed to do something. Nyesa does some good damage, I think. Where is the loot? Alright, where the hell am I going? That way. It's 
Let's get the hell out of here. Hopefully I don't have to come back to this place. Because I'm seriously tired uh, of the whole back and forth. I may start to skip uh, side missions. Oh, I can't open this while this is happening. What? There are creatures in the room. You can't open a door. How would that work? How would you possibly open a door while there is someone else in the room? Video games. Can I open the door now? There we go. Good job. Off we go. Yep. I should probably take uh, Scott with me for that. It would make sense if he had more... Wait. Would... Actually, I don't think she would like that. Hi, How are you? Hello, Can I actually Julia. take Scott? I didn't want to talk to you. No, he's locked. Alright, that makes sense. I was thinking he should uh, be able to offer more dialogue, but... Uh, it will... make things... Uh, <laughs> uncomfortable, I guess. Maybe they smuggled the sun out. An accident. Something he couldn't avoid. It's happened to us after all. Maybe. I just want to find out. That's all I'm asking. I don't. I fear I may be getting sick. Sorry, Scott. I understand that looking for the remains of your best friend is probably. How is he in this conversation? Amelia deserves That's answers. weird. Sometimes the past just gives us answers we were afraid to know. I just hope that won't be the case this time. Even if we find the rover wreck, it'd be easy pickings for a passing scavenger or thief. So there might not be much left. The fuck you say that for? Sorry, I just don't want you to get your hopes up. Whoa, Amelia, ease up. I know you want answers, but it's probably best not to crash while looking for a crash site. You kidding me? I wonder what you'd say if we actually went fast. I guess everyone's version of moderate is different. Damn, the rover's still here. Hmm. I would have bet it would have been scrapped by now. Well, some parts oh. are goners, but most of it's still here. Yeah. Why couldn't we take Scott then? I'm sorry, but this time I don't have any doubt. I know. Thanks, Asha. But yeah, I knew it was dead. I just wanted to know how and why, you know? And I still plan to, with what's here. <sighs> Ah, okay, this guy's having one shot. Stop playing with your food. I'm guessing that's what we are eating, right? We haven't actually seen the characters eat, but I'm guessing they eat the local creatures somehow. All right, anything here? Grandmaster gloves, great master's breastplate. You actually get loot. 
Oh yeah. Fucking finally. I need better... That's a nice uniform. I need better pants though, or legs. Yeah, I'll put those. They're better looking. Uh, is that a tablet? Looks like we found a tablet. And it still works. Oh, I'm probably lose that. I don't know if you'll ever get this message. It doesn't really matter now, I guess. Of my own piece, I, I just need to... So many things I wish I could tell you. My last thoughts and breaths are filled with regrets. I can't even blame you for sabotaging my rover. I was supposed to be your friend. I, I was supposed to be there for you. I was supposed to try to empathize with all the hurt and fear you were going through. But all I could bring myself to care about is making you stop obsessing about your son. Make you go back to being your old self for my own benefit. To have my old friend back. It was selfish. I was selfish. Even from the outset. The only reason I ever helped was just to help bring an end to the obsessing. And in the end, my own obsession. But that goal led me to take away your son so you would stop. I wanted to take him so far away that you'd have no recourse but to give up hope. But you figured me out. You stopped me, and now I'm paying for it. I'm so thirsty. The rover is becoming... Twists unbearable. everywhere. Unbearably hot. Forgive me, my friend, as I forgive you. Tell my daughter I'm sorry for not being courageous enough to keep her by my side. I should have fought for her. Stopped her from being taken away from me. Between the two of us, you were always the better father. Good to your boy. And here I am. Is it... Never mind. Farewell, Scott. Take good care of Amelia for me, my friend. I can't even... Well then. He was here the whole time? Not even that far from Ophir. Uh, we know. Find out who sabotaged his rover. Who's also, I think he's out there. Dying. You find something? No, that makes no sense. Yeah, I found this. There's a message on it, Amelia. One you're not going to be happy to hear. Whatever it is, it's better than not knowing the truth. Give it. Ignorance is bliss. I don't know if you. I can't even blame you for sabotaging my rover. to be there for you. I was supposed to try to empathize with all the hurt. The only reason I ever helped was just to help that bring an end to the obsessing. So far and in the end, that you tell my daughter I'm sorry for to give up being courageous now, enough to keep her by my side. I should have fought for her. Take good Stop. care of Amelia for me, my friend. Where the hell, Scott? Where is he? Uh, yeah, Scott is not the issue. Relax. From what I hear, the, your father kinda had it coming. But I guess we'll see in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, leave a comment if you want to. And I'll see you next time with a conclusion of this quest. And more Technomancer.